Well, that was fun. I have to be quiet. Everybody's asleep. I find I'm being <clears throat> followed by conservatives on Substack. Ooh, ooh, ooh. The mighty Geert Hardas dismantling Mika. Quote, this is a nation born of dissent and treason. Good treason, John Lewis might have said. Mika's eyes widen as she knows she has been hit, not ever knowing she is a brick in a fascist wall. The words, the cliches surround her like deployed airbags, but she keeps driving. It's not IQ. She, for all I know, is Mensa. It is an emotional choice to be safe. She sees one America. He sees the other. He likes reality. She doesn't. Aren't these protests like January the 6th, she says? Condemnable? Yes, he says. They are both evidence that something is happening. Some part of the us is disturbed. We don't know what it is and we don't want to know. She wants it to go away. It is outside agitators always for Mika, outside her small circle, outside thoughts, intuitions she'll not permit. It's the only way. The greatest country on the face of the earth can handle dissent, arrest it, allow the police to be violent. The country was born of dissent and genocide, some students said. I don't like these kids. The students with their absolutes, blocking a Jewish boy from class in some Western Ivy League, Stanford. I don't like him either, to be honest. But he and they are us, not outside agitators. The rest of the Joe crew, the men, emphasize these words. These explain alls, then stare into the empty space their pronouncement has made, like alcoholics on Sunday morning, as awake as they'll ever be. The ish, dears, is that the outside is inside. They have Trojan horse and are running in the streets, these best and brightest. That might be the most galling. Our we precious ones, our princesses, our apex intellects, our highest achievers spitting in faces. They used to be so cute, they will again. It's just the outsiders, masked, like Antifa's infiltrating BLM, trans polit politicals. You cannot see to shoot. Wait till they graduate before you grovel to and superstar them. They'll be in the party. This lot Democrats condemning their descendants, ruining their youths for the big bucks. Like Sager from Breaking Point speaking such self-serving cowardice, Crystal just stared. Pluralism isn't just religious or racial or culture. It's much harder. Jefferson didn't lie about equality. He had no idea what it was. He wrote into a fledgling project the same laws against agitators his forefathers had, and nobody agitated. Outsiders were, well, uh, anyone not white male and property owning outside. Nobody held him to any account. Nobody else could speak, vote. The outsider could not agitate. Any try was gunned down. Thomas was the 18th century Joe Scarborough. This is what we did until Anand, with that impossible hair, I am so glad he got through and they ask him back. Maybe not again, Joe, Mika and the bobblehead show. He is a Trojan horse. There could be multitudes to follow, outsiders agitating Mika. She's going to get her gun like Annie. Naomi Klein Quote, if you think the next Trump will be the previous buffoon, you are sorely mistaken. He's more angry, more aggrieved, more unhinged. And therefore, Naomi, more likely to win? And having won, more likely to, des to destroy more of the greatest polity in the history of the world, which failed to anticipate and address those grievances. Naomi, you are describing a monarchy. We might change kings, but monarchs they are. Donald Trump, Liz Truss, Richie Sunak, La Pen, Victor, Orban, Netanyahu are all reflections of their homicidally grumpy constituencies. Condemning these other constituencies as f and for whatever, but essentially for not being you, is not democratic. It is all the rest. 
with the worst just down the road. It is why the worst happens. Trump is a squalling, inarticulate baby because at least half of America is, or half of each of us. Parentheses, it isn't half. If it isn't half, why haven't you dumped the electrical college, that most oligarchic of institutions, end parenthesis. A friend of mine is teaching young children uh, who have already been scrap heaped. They're clever children, readers, who cannot pass tests. They are stigmatized all day and naturally bite their thumbs at us who stigmatize. I've met some of these blades over the years, and yes, they are laughing at us as fools. You will translate this troop the way you have ever since the beginning of Protestantism. Minimize, and unless you change, they will confound you over and over. I have been researching Rome, you know that, our military state model, and even they decided magistrates should not be appointed but elected, and then for a year, us, appointed for life. It was a hot day, too hot that day in Philadelphia, I guess. The blindness of imagining systems are perfect, corrupted by deficient humans, will get you a hot mess every time. We know how corrupt our money-sodden system is. Imagining you can fix it because you are better people just leaves the corruption in charge. I love Naomi big time and Yanis Varoufakis, with whom she was speaking, but their dark belief in the deep, helpless, gullible, corruptible masses makes me throw up a little bit.